This is Dabu 7. And I want to point out the fact that this whole situation here in Ferguson has been nothing more than a huge psyop. And what it's done is it's achieved a couple different things. For those that have been sitting back paying attention and watching, first thing you notice is that they stated that this was a white cop that had shot a young black teen. Now they've released who the cop is, Darren Wilson. The story's changed, and did you notice? They never once stated this whole time that there was an armed robbery until now. And there's a couple reasons for that. The first being, if they would have stated this out the gate, they would have never got the chaos that they so wanted. They were able to bring in their military equipment. They were able to chase out news crews. They were able to do all of these things that they set up tactically, all in the psychological warfare that they're waging on the minds of the people. Now, it did not help that the people behaved like animals in the streets and gave them what they wanted. But in a sense, they initially were hoping for Trayvon Martin round two, where it was going to be black on white, because that was the initial reports, a white cop gunned down an unarmed black teen. And that's how it was pushed on the masses to fuel the people. Never a mention of an armed robbery. Right. So they come, they wait they're, they're, they're playing this whole thing out, timing it out, seeing how they could play their cards. If the people were still enraged enough and provoked when they dropped the name in the face of this individual, this cop that shot him, it would have provoked more rage. But it hasn't because what they've done is they've installed this. That now there was a robbery, an arm uh, a strong-armed, strong-armed robbery where he stole a box of Swisher Sweets. And we have no proof of what really happened from this video clip. I'll tell you that he does shove him. There, I'll leave links. It's every single place right now is jammed. The video is just like not playing anywhere. There's, a, there's one piece here in the BBC. You can see him shove him off of him right there. But we don't know what took place exactly right there. So at this point, I just want to state that, hey, this whole thing has worked into the advantage in the favor of who? You guessed it. They provoked the people. They got to test out some new things, see how the people would respond. And they got all the information that they were looking for. And they silenced this right on cue. And this was the trick. This was the trick. You see, at first, it was, would they take the bait for, for Trayvon Martin type deal? We didn't. Then it was just the people all together against the police. That's what they didn't really want to have. Okay? So at that point, they were able to simmer the whole thing down, coming in with smiling faces and saying they're, they're going to release the name, but making sure that when they release the name, they drop the biggest bombshell of it all. That, oops, we forgot to tell everybody this guy was involved in an armed robbery. You see, and if the riots would have got way out of hand and they're just now dropping this, one of the guys in the, the guys in the streets that got a brick in their hand ready to smash the windows like, what? They're saying he robbed him. What? they dropping it to go find out what really happened now. Starting to feel like fools. But then many other people were like, no, this is a setup. It's a setup. There's no way. There's no doubt in my mind from looking at the footage here if this is exactly how it went down from what I'm seeing. It looks like there was some kind of altercation in the store. Is there any proof that this guy stole anything? None. Is there proof that he had an altercation with the guy that you see here? Yes, but that's enough to feed the sheep. And this guy walks out of the store, gets gunned down. You can see right here in the timeline. And what's it done? It's incited anger across the whole country. People marching in New York all over the place because of this. Now what are they doing? 